Hey guys, what's up? It's becoming you from GNA today. So this is my newest tactical 22. This is the Umarex slash Walther H and K MP5. This is the A5. This rifle is actually made by Umarex, and uh, I've got a whole long video to prove that. The main thing is is looking at the proof marks. It has a little shield with three crowns in it. It means that it was probably nearly absolutely made by Umarex. Now. Walther, I believe, has had some input on helping Umarex to make them better, but it is actually made uh, at the Umarex factory in Arnsberg, which is a very close drive to the Cologne Proof House. So anyways, this is a this rifle's been around for a long time, so th there's plenty of videos on this. I just thought I'd show it, because I'm going to start doing some comparison videos with this thing also. The DE stands for Deutsch, made in Germany, the CIP over N, that's the nitro proof, meaning it's been test fired. Shield with three crowns means it was proofed by the Cologne Proof House, and that BG is the date code, A is zero, B is one, and so forth, so BG is going to be one, six, I believe. So, this rifle was made in 2016, this is a very uh, new construction rifle. And I do have the GSG 522, and I've done the conversion to put the smooth grip and all that back on it, but I've been wanting one of these for a while. Finally decided to do it so I can go ahead and complete my collection on the Umarex Walther rifles. This thing is pretty sweet. <clears throat> so the main difference between the M or the A5 and the SD and all that is just the different type of can they have on this, which of course is just a fake can on here, just to hide that this has to be a 16 inch barrel. Very sweet rifle. I will be doing some shooting with this thing. It's been uh, been crazy with Christmas, and it's going to be hard to get anything done over the next few week or two. But uh, anyways, I'm gonna try to get out to the range, do some shooting with it, and then do some comparisons of this to to some of my other rifles. Specifically, the first one's going to be to the GSG version of this rifle. There you go. Pretty awesome. Be coming from GNA today. Thanks for watching.